energy influx, reinforcements have arrived, what is a dragon, Confucius and Lao Tzu, Spotlight Archangel Azrael. Today's date on the Archangelic calendar is Infinity OL 49 L 799 Infinity Infinity B 116666 Infinity Infinity B 1 TT Infinity Calendar legend and other information is available at archangelicalendar.com. And please do not forget to like, comment, share and subscribe. Gaia is earth and water dominant which creates clay, this is the alchemic foundation of physical masses and can thus be molded. Earth will be very responsive to your thoughts, words and actions, so be careful the way that you use them. This is also in divine essence and timing with the new moon. There is an energy influx that we nicknamed the quantum access grants. This is a powerful universal energy that dives into our lives in a very personal way and is associated with the circumference of divinity unlike previous influxes WH. O had a specific point of origins. This energy influx is also much different than the prior ones because it will cause a lull or deep in pressure before it turns itself on full blast. This energy is an express route to allowing for the many lightworkers to get relief in their personal lives. This was warranted for many reasons, the most important of which is that as a collective, we have made so many personal sacrifices to get to this point of evolution, not succeeding, is not an option. This is the universe's way of helping us on a macro scale and is a microcosm of what I detailed in yes. Today's post. To accompany this you will notice increased sky activity via our star family. It is abundantly clear that direct interference from the star races have already begun. Politically speaking, it was the Syrian, Pledian, Arturian alliance that forced all other governing bodies to play a more direct role in Earth's affairs. Organized darkness called off a major attack upon humanity because they couldn't find a timeline where they succeeded, and has thus given up on their plan. We are beyond checkmate at this point, and we are anticipating a swift end to the corruption that Humani. Tai has been enslaved by it to begin momentarily. Dragons are an amazing energetic anomaly that runs on their own schedule and acts as a regulatory system with a very specific function. They are conscious, yet non-objective regulators of energy who take very large forms, when our mind observes them. Oceans. Much like all things, the mind needs to take in the data it gets and arrange it into some form of logical mass. The form this energy takes is subjective but given the nature of electricity one can easily see how the mind can try to compile this data into the form of a dragon. The best way I can describe to you what a dragon actually is, is by presenting to the ending of the story of Lao Tzu and Confucius meeting. When Confucius came back from meeting Lao Tzu, he didn't speak for three days. His students grew concerned and asked him what had happened. Confucius said, I know how a bird can fly. I know how a fish can swim. But I do not know how Lao Tzu could rise and fly like a sublime dragon riding on clouds in the sky. Quote, Lao Tzu ripped Confucius' teachings to shreds, he enlightened him in such a way that broke him down and forced him to reevaluate his approach. Despite such a hard slap to the face, Confucius was wise enough to self-reflect. This story lays the truth of dragons, they move energy forward no matter what dimension they are in. Archangel Azrael is a very interesting being, he is extremely wise and is able to find a solution to the most impossible things. Many people confuse him with the Archangel of Destruction Azrael, because they look similar and clearly have phonetic similarities to match. He can organize billions of souls with ease and he assists our entire population in the incarnation process. Nicknamed the Angel of Death because he helps people find their way home after leaving their bodies, but to be clear he does not function the way the stereotypical, Grim Reaper character is portrayed. He is a blue-collar angel that works super hard to assist all beings with great love and compassion. 
Advice is his specialty, even though he is not known for it, and he can be extremely vocal when prompted. Do not hesitate to call upon the special archangel, he is an amazing ally on all levels. Most of humanity's 7.8 billion people do not have enough belief in their ability to work metaphysically as of yet. If that is not the case, and for most light workers it is not, feel free to use your own tools and abilities for assignments. For the others, the tools below will help you bridge the belief gap, as your belief in the said being would come into play as well. The following tools will only be available until the mark of the next Archangelic Day, next day's official post, if you are catching this on a later date. You can use the current daily tools for previous assignments. Envision yourself using said tools with a pure heart and intentions. A warning to all who try to yield unworthy, these things have their own will. Please make a mental note of what you wish to equip. Passive equals no intention needed to use or arm, it will work on its own when you accept its presence. All you need to do is give permission and it will work on your behalf. Active equals intention needed to use. Aggressive equals will attack before anything has a chance to do any harm to you. Active, passive and aggressive anywhere within the universe. The violet flame team has shifted but remains in the balance of a strong six. This means that we are shifting in a very major way, hold tight this is day two of this forms chin. The violet flame team is as follows, and is in no particular order, Archangel Germain, Archangel Anseel, Archangel Orion, Archangel Raguel, Archangel Briathos, Archangel Sablo, Archangel Emmanuel, Arch. Angel Bathkol, Archangel Af, Archangel Adonai, Archangel Agla, Archangel GZ Rail, Archangel Adnashil, Archangel Vanyal, Archangel Azil, Archangel Tatrazil, Archangel Muriel, Archangel Machdil, Archangel Servil, Archangel Eshma, Archangel Abraxos, Archangel Abastashon, Archangel Galazur, and Arch. Angel Zadekil. Active Long and Short Range. Archangel Michael's legendary sword can handle anything, as it is completely omnipotent, there is no level of consciousness that can be achieved that this couldn't slice through. It is also an amazing weapon against electronics and technology as it can override any circuitry. Active Long Range, Passive, Active and Aggressive Short Range Archangel Isix Radiant Field looks a lot like Magneto's Foss Field and it reacts to any life form with either loving energy, or with transmutational blast of vast power. Passive and aggressive, long or short range anything in your jurisdiction. Archangel Leo's Swords of Plenty, is a passive and aggressive attack sword that has a complete will of its own. Do not try to yield at all, you will only get in the way, just equip and go about your day. Active. Archangel Nye's Wand of Truth will provide tests for various reasons, if no reason is set, it will test for intention and willingness to harm. Active, passive and aggressive. Archangel Pengius Omaha is a great sword of reveal as it acts very aggressively upon your behalf. It will also go out of its way to clear lower timelines and make all situations go in a more positive direction. Passive Short Range Archangel Gabriel's Shield of Truth allows righteousness and justice to be your greatest defense. When equipped, this allows truth to protect and serve us. This shield also helps bring abundance to our lives. Passive and Active Any Range Archangel Ezekiel's Medal of Radiance allows you to radiate healing and protective energy to yourself and all that you wish to send this to. Passive and Aggressive Short and Long Range Archangel Harut Sob of Radiant Blast hits like a metaphysical neutron bomb to anyone who wishes to do you harm. It keeps anyone giving you the evil eye from harming you energetically as well. Passive and Aggressive Archangel Shepherd Zob is a presence of divinity that allows anyone that you are engaged with a clear path to forgiveness or a direct audience with infinitely expanding creator source on the matter. This is a truly compassionate tool of divine orchestration. Please note the next three tools are meant to be used in combination. They are sent to us to help us sustain our physical bodies. 
प्लीज कीप यूजिंग दिस टूल डेली वी आर स्टार्टिंग टू रिमूव द एनर्जी ब्लॉकेजेस सराउंडिंग अबंडेंस इफ यू नीड हेल्प यूजिंग द बिलो टूल्स एंड विजन गोल्ड बाज यूजिंग आर्क एंजल अरेज वॉन्ट एंड सेट इट ऑन फायर यूजिंग आर्क एंजल नसारा गेज एंड आर्क एंजल इसराफिल सॉड्स I say envision gold because Gaia controls gold and cash money. Well, you yeah, know that story. Also, the Galactic Federation trades in gold and manifesting in this method also aligns with their currency methods and any divinity-based currency system. Active Archangel Ares wand of comforts helps you summon any necessity you may have. It is a wonderful and comforting tool when equipped. active aggressive and passive long and short range archangel israfil's flaming sword can protect you against all things directed to you on a macro or micro scale it can also speed up the time in which something you wish to manifest will come to fruition active aggressive and passive long and short range archangel nasaragi's flaming sword can bring any negative energy to its knees It also has the ability to remove any and all obstacles that are in the way of something that you wish to manifest. Assignments: One, we were alerted to a situation under the Golden Gate Bridge. When we investigates, we discovered an entangled timeline cluster. This means that many unstable timelines are converging in that area in error. Although too numerous to list all but one of these timelines end in a severely disabled golden gate bridge and many unnecessary casualties we may be able to aid the issue by collapsing the lower timelines that are connected to this catastrophic event as to avoid as many casualties to sentient life as possible use white ray light to highlight the timelines attached to this catastrophe on the bridge if you see dark smoking cords cut them If you see colored ones, help anchor them more firmly. The more people who do this exercise, the better changes that we have for a positive outcome. Two, Saturn has had two days of recalibration therapy, and it is doing amazingly well. The only thing left to do is to solidify our work. This will be accomplished by a blanket of diamond plasma to the portal at the pole, along with golden flames engulfing the remainder of the planet. 3 we must be proactive in insisting that the truth be served to humanity immediately what is hidden must be revealed where there is darkness we will light it up it is time to push this along there is a specific kind of light that can be used in these situations it is nicknamed binding light because it is its own source of light and can spread independently much like a liquid wood this liquid light glows in and of its own accord Bring this liquid light to every orifice of humanity and be sure to include all levels of social hierarchy in media. And please do not forget to like, comment, share and subscribe.